I'm Kenton Sefcik, registered acupuncturist, and this is TCM Graduate TV. On this episode, episode 13, we're going to review the last influential point, REN12. Welcome back. Today, we're going to review REN12, which is influential of food. If you recall from the last episode, we said that Zhang is not Yang in regards to liver 13. So that means that Fu is Yang. If you're working with any Fu organs, you can use Ren 12 to augment your treatment. Liver 13 was a very powerful acupuncture point, not only because it's influential of Zhang, because it was the front move of the spleen. REN12 is the front mu collecting point of the stomach. If you have a patient that's having any stomach concerns, you can use REN12 for excess or deficiency conditions. We can use REN12 for most all stomach conditions, but sometimes we defer to a couple other ones, and we can't talk about REN12 without talking about them. I don't make a very good artist, but I make a pretty good acupuncturist. This is a pretty crude drawing of your stomach. And we can divide it up into three sections. The upper section is called Shang Wan or upper stomach or cavity. The middle part is called Zhang Wan or middle cavity. The lower part is called Xia Wan or lower cavity. Zhang Wan is represented by Ren 12. Shang Wan is represented by Ren 13. And Xia Wan is represented by Ren 10. Again, Zhong Wan can be used for any excess or deficiency conditions. And the way I learned it is that Ren 13 is very good for excess, whereas Ren 10 is very good for deficiency conditions. Just gonna take a minute to try to explain that the way I think about it. This part is actually called the cardia because it's close to the heart, so you can think cardiac. This lower portion is called the pylorus. And the middle part is called the body. The cardia has a sphincter that's responsible for not letting gastric juices come back up through the esophagus. So this would seem very excess in my opinion. And the pylorus is responsible for keeping the sphincter closed so no bile comes back up. Yes, there can be symptoms because of that burning stomach as well, but when this remains closed, the stomach can do its job by creating chyme that gastric juice is mixed in with your food so that it can absorb the nutrients and you get very strong. So that's why I view this as kind of an excess, excess deficiency and deficiency treatment. And there you have it. A really good reason to use REN12. I usually go by my patients because they're the best barometer for success and diagnosis. I ask them where their discomfort is and I go by that. When in regards to REN13, sometimes that hiatal hernia or heartburn symptoms up are a little higher. So I might use a REN14, REN15. And I just want to remind you that safety is king, bedside manner is king, and results are king. In that order. Thank you so much. We'll see you next week.